welcome to my channel. My name is Lisa. Um, today we are going to be working on the Marguerite Miller Challenge for week 22. So the prompts are uh, people. I've got a couple of those. I've got this lady on a spinning cycle, which is also the second prompt, something that uh, twirls or spins. Um, and then I have this uh, lady on a globe. The globe spins. She's a person and also starts with G, which is the third prompt. I have the airplane propeller. Um, which spins, and then something that starts with a G, I have a gnome, or a gnome, <laughs> I have a goat, and um, again, I have the lady on the globe. And then uh, book page text, I have this uh, date, I've got some date stamps, and bonus sticker, um, I have the letter G, uh, st which is a sticker, and the globe, and um, uh, the lady on a bike are also stickers, so i got those a uh, couple different ways to do stickers. All right, so we are going to start by gluing the propeller down. Um, I think it's going to take a lot of glue. Probably going to make, make me uh, um, use my whole glue stick here. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get this uh, laid down. Take me a second here, but uh, hopefully you're having a wonderful day. Um, I know I am. I like uh, crafting... Uh, these challenges I do with my uh, sister and my mom, so occasionally you'll see a, a weird thing going through. So, all right. So book page text next. Um, I've noticing that the book was around the world in eighty days, so I thought that was pretty appropriate for uh, using in front of an uh, airplane propeller. Yeah, nice. All right. So I noticed the top of the page was kind of a little bit blank, so I decided to use the. This would be a good place to put the date stamp. Um, so I found an older date that. Um, uh, would go with a bit of an older book. Uh, now I found these stamps um, through Timo, I believe. Um, I hadn't used them before, but uh, I think they came out pretty nice. I, I definitely like them, and um, I am sure I'm going to be using them uh, again. Yeah, definitely like them. All right, so get my stickers on here. I've got my uh, person with the thing that twists and spins. I got the goat. Put the goat on the propeller. Why not? kind of figured out it's a little blank here so I think I'm going to have to move my lady over a bit uh, what can I put in this place the globe or the gnome and the gnome is going to win so we'll get the gnome stuck down and we'll get her the person with the spinny bike And this is where I ran out of glue stick and had to get a new one. <laughs> I knew that Bob Prowler did that, would do that, so. All right, new glue stick. We'll get Lady down with the spinny thing. Yeah. All right, and then we got um, the goat on the propeller. Okay, making sure everything is nice and nice and glued down. Okay. Now, the final thing that I do um, after I've gotten all these uh, prompts down is um, I use the Tim Holtz uh, snippets. Um, kind of find something to tie in together. So, track that book down. And where is it? Who's got it? There we go. We've tracked it down. All right, and right off the bat on the first page, I found something that said it is a long journey. I thought that was perfect to go with the around the world in 80 days and the uh, propeller would be a nice long journey yeah works good okay so um, after I'm done with the uh, challenge uh, I flip the page over and we attach the prompt uh, to the back and anything that I didn't use from the front so I've got the other half of the bottom half of the book page for the text I'm gonna glue on the bottom we'll start with that And then I'm going to glue the prompt down. Okay. So I have the lady with the globe. So I got the triple thread there. I decided to put her on that side. So she's uh, got the people, something that spins the globe, and letter G. I've got the sticker, which is also the G. And then the only other thing I haven't used um, on this back is 
a date. So I decided to uh, use my date stamps again. Why not do one of everything on the back? Kind of like a, a mini collage. Worked out good. I don't always use every single prompt, but this one I happen to. So we'll get this inked up. And we will add the date stamp. Wonderful. Okay. All right, so we did get everything on the back, which is awesome. Put the stamps away. And I really do, really do like that stamp set. So, all right. Well, that is going to be it for me today. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you'd like to see more from me, um, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, a thumbs up would be wonderful. And as usual, have a wonderful and a creative night. Bye now.